Hello, welcome to the Spoon for Heart Kitchen. สวัสดีค่ะ My name is Siri. Today I'm going to make the my favorite pot sticker dipping sauce or น้ำจิ้มติ่มซัม Okay, so the recipe today is requested by uh, Donna. So she asked me what my favorite the pot sticker dipping sauce. So I know a lot, a lot the recipe um, for the pot sticker dipping sauce. But this is my version and my favorite. So gonna be quick and easy. I'm going to show you today. And thank you again for Donna to request this recipe. And first, I'm going to start with the black soy sauce. And with the black soy sauce, I think I have a one of my video talking about this black soy sauce they even make from the beer bottle from the beer EO. Uh, you can see this. And I have one question from our subscriber Leanne. She bought the black soy sauce and she don't know how to open. So. I mean, I just told her already from the comment, but today I'm just gonna show you maybe some of you guys having same uh, issue, same problem. So this one, of course, they don't have any pull out uh, thing to open. The way to open, let me get the knife. <laughs> the way when I buy and open, you just have to be careful. You can put grub or something, but for me, I just grab it and then I just cut it from the bottom. Be careful, just cut it and. I know, so now you don't have the lid, right? For this one, and then I use a foil to just like cover them when I using. I just cover like this, but of course, sometimes in Thailand they not even cover them; they just leave them open. All right, in the pantry, or you just want to cover them. All right, so sorry to. <laughs> okay, mention a lot of things. Now we're going to start cooking. Okay, so. First, I'm going to start with the black soy sauce. I will use three tablespoons black soy sauce. If you use a little bit, you can cut them half, or if you like it a lot, use it a lot, you can double the recipe. So three tablespoons, all right, for the black soy sauce. All right, next it's gonna be soy sauce. I'm going to use two tablespoons soy sauce. Your favorite soy sauce will work. One and two. And next, my favorite seasoning soy sauce. Okay. Two tablespoons golden mountain seasoning soy sauce. Or if you don't have, you just can use all the soy sauce. I'm gonna put two tablespoons the seasoning soy sauce. Or you can use Mackey, that will be uh, very close to the Golden Mountain too. Okay, two tablespoon. Okay, of course the baby want to be next to me, so she have her show ready now, and she can watching me. All right, so now we have all the salt in it. Next, I going to put the balance all the salt in it with the white vinegar. So I gonna use four tablespoon white vinegar. Four tablespoon. One, wait, two. <laughs> three and four okay all right and next i'm going to add a uh, sugar same thing i'm going to use four tablespoon the sugar okay now i'm going to mix until all the sugar will combine all the sugar dissolve okay just uh maybe just a minute Okay, so now I um, mix about one minute. Now my sugar all dissolved. I'm going to give this a quick test. Mm -hmm. If you want more salty or you want more uh, sour, you can add it on like now. Okay, so next I'm going to add um, is it um, sesame oil, <laughs> one teaspoon sesame oil. Okay, just a little bit. All right. Um, don't forget if you like more sour, you can add more vinegar like right now, or you like more salty, you can add more soy sauce. All right. Now I give it. That's it. That's all our pastica sauce, and then I have all this option. This is optional for you. For my personal that I like to add on, you can do it separate, you can do different. I have my um, homemade chili oil. You can add chili oil if you like spicy. And then 
um, with more flavor you can add the green onion it will go very very good with and you can add the this is the ginger this is a chopped ginger but try to cut them very small for the ginger okay this is this is um simple and easy the classic one but if you like more flavor the what i like to do at home i like to add some ginger okay it's a must that you like or if you don't like ginger you like the pain flavor so just just stop like that but i like to add some ginger and next i like to add some green onion i this is one green onion okay so about ginger about like um one tablespoon the ginger one and a half tablespoon ginger all right and give this a good mix mm, look at this the ginger and the green onion will give you a really really good flavor if you like spicy i'm not gonna put the chili in in this because somebody might not like spicy the chili we can add on in and separate okay so i just want to give this a taste and try this with the pot sticker that i just made okay so my personal i like to put a little bit inside my bowl and then i like to add some spicy so i add the chili oil Mm. and then this is mine and then i'm going to mix who like more spicy can put more or who don't like spicy not add to not have to add the chili oil and now mm, i'm going to try with the pot sticker mm. Mm. i like them um, They have a sour and spicy. This is very spicy. I add a lot of chili oil. Mm -hmm. I think you will, um, Donna, I think you will like this recipe. Mm. No! <laughs> mm. Look at all the salt. Okay, thank you again for Donna to um, liquid this recipe and also for the pot sticker. I have the recipe on episode 99. I will put the link for you below the clip or I hope the cameraman can put the, the link up here too, somewhere here so you can click on it and then you can see the my pot sticker recipe too. Alright, I hope th you like this quick, easy. Um, Postica like dipping salt. I hope you like this video. Thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, if you like this recipe, please give me a thumb up, subscribe, and you will see me for the next recipe. Thank you. Bye. 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 <laughs>